Hello, this is David Hale with Tech Dive TV Help Desk. Today's edition of Tech Dive TV Help Desk talks about how to speed up your computer without adding more memory. Now, let's say you've maxed out the memory in your computer. You can't add any more based on its configuration. And your computer is starting to slow down. Well, you can always defragment your hard drive, but that won't really give you much speed. Um, but you could replace your hard drive. You can replace your standard HDD or hard disk drive with an SSD, a solid state drive. Now the difference between a normal hard drive and a solid state drive is a normal hard drive has platters that spin, spin, spin and heads that read the platters, okay? Well, a solid state drive has no moving parts at all. It's all basically high speed memory, but in the form of a hard drive. So it's storage rather than, you know, random access memory, it's storage, it stores your files, your documents, your photos, just like a hard drive does. But it's about a hundred times faster than a typical hard drive. So when you boot your computer in the morning, it boots almost instantly. And accessing your files, your, your, all your pictures, photos, movies, videos, everything like that is very, very fast. Now I just purchased a 240 gig SSD for about $89. So take a look and, you know, you can get up to a terabyte, but those are, those are pretty expensive. But take a look at, you know, how much are you really using of the hard drive you have? A lot of computers come with big 500 gig or one terabyte hard drives, but how much are you actually using? So you think to yourself, oh, my computer currently has a 500 gig hard drive. Why would I want to go down to a 240 gig hard drive? Well, maybe you're not using the 500 gig. Also, there are cloud storage places that you could use for storing large files that you don't necessarily need on your hard drive all the time. Uh, that way you could access them from pretty much any device. But yeah, consider replacing your hard drive with an SSD. Now, that does mean you're gonna have to reinstall your operating system and your applications. So it's not something you just plop out, plop in a new drive and you're done. So plan for time when you wanna rebuild all the files that you have. Make sure you back everything up before you do this because you don't wanna lose any files. So. Go ahead, look at an SSD, go to your computer store or look on the internet and see if I'm, what I'm saying is it's as true as you think it is because I've researched it myself. So this is David Hale from Tech Dive TV Help Desk. Have a great day.